Humanity aims to explore beyond the inner planets, reaching destinations like Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus, and Neptune. Our current propulsion systems, chemical rockets and solar power, face limitations. Recent research presented at the 56th Lunar and Planetary Science Conference introduces fission-powered propulsion, a nuclear technology that could address these challenges. Fission propulsion offers a reliable, long-lasting power source, enabling deep space missions to distant planets and beyond. In this video, we'll explore how this innovative technology could transform space travel and expand humanity's reach in the cosmos. Fission-powered propulsion represents a fundamental shift in how we think about powering space exploration. But what exactly does that mean? <clears throat> to break it down, fission is the process of splitting atomic nuclei, releasing large amounts of energy. This energy can be used to either generate electricity for electric propulsion systems or directly produce thrust using nuclear thermal propulsion. At the heart of this technology are two main approaches, fission electric propulsion and fission thermal propulsion. FEP utilizes a nuclear reactor to generate electricity, which is then used to power electric thrusters. These thrusters are highly efficient for deep space travel, offering the advantage of gradually increasing velocity over long distances. This method is particularly useful for missions that need to travel beyond the reach of the sun, where solar power would be ineffective. FTP, on the other hand, involves using the heat produced by a nuclear reactor to create thrust directly. This method is more similar to traditional rocket propulsion, but is far more efficient. By using nuclear heat, spacecraft can achieve much higher thrust-to-weight ratios than with chemical propulsion. What makes fission propulsion stand out is its high energy density. Unlike chemical propulsion, which burns fuel and rapidly depletes it, nuclear reactors offer a steady, long-term power source that can last for years, even decades. This is particularly crucial for long-duration missions, like those aimed at exploring distant planets like Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus, and Neptune. These missions can take years to complete, and traditional power sources simply aren't sustainable for such lengthy journeys. The research presented at the Lunar and Planetary Science Conference examines how fission propulsion could enable faster and more efficient travel to these far-off destinations. This is a breakthrough in space propulsion technology, offering the ability to power spacecraft for extended periods, operate in environments far from the sun, and reduce mission durations. Right now, the distances between Earth and outer planets are immense. Take, for example, the distance to Neptune, which is over 30 astronomical units AU away. 1 AU is the distance from Earth to the Sun, approximately 93 million miles. With current chemical propulsion technologies, a mission to Neptune would take many years, but with nuclear-powered propulsion, those journey times could be drastically shortened. The ability to achieve faster travel to outer planets opens up possibilities for larger payloads, including more scientific instruments, crewed missions, and even long-term habitability systems. But the implications of this technology extend even further. Consider the possibility of interstellar missions, missions to explore other star systems. The nearest star, Proxima Centauri, is over four light years away. Using current propulsion technologies, a journey to Proxima Centauri would take tens of thousands of years. However, fission propulsion combined with electric or ion propulsion systems could drastically reduce the time it would take to reach such distant stars. For missions to other star systems, high thrust nuclear thermal propulsion could be used to accelerate a spacecraft to high speeds and quickly exit the solar system. Once the spacecraft is in deep space, long duration electric propulsion powered by nuclear reactors could maintain the spacecraft's velocity for the remainder of the journey. While we're not yet close to achieving interstellar travel, Nuclear propulsion is one of the few technologies that could make such missions conceivable in the future. In addition to expanding our ability to explore distant worlds, 
fission-powered propulsion could also make it possible to send probes to exoplanets, planets orbiting other stars. These missions could provide data that helps us understand whether life could exist elsewhere in the galaxy. It's a groundbreaking shift in our capacity to explore the cosmos, and fission propulsion could be the key to realizing these ambitious goals. So, what does all of this mean for the future of space exploration? First, fission propulsion could play a critical role in human exploration of the outer planets. Mars missions in particular could benefit from the advantages offered by nuclear propulsion, significantly reducing travel times and increasing payload capacity. With reliable nuclear power systems on board, astronauts could have the energy they need to power life support, scientific instruments, and communication systems throughout their journey. Beyond Mars, fission propulsion would allow humanity to set its sights on the outer planets, Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus, and Neptune. These planets, along with their moons, are some of the most intriguing targets for future exploration, offering the potential for discovering new forms of life or unlocking the secrets of our solar system's formation. Nuclear-powered propulsion would allow us to explore these worlds in ways that were previously unimaginable. But the benefits don't stop with missions to our solar system. As humanity pushes into interstellar space, nuclear propulsion could make it possible to send probes to the nearest stars, such as Proxima Centauri or Alpha Centauri. While we're still a long way from sending humans beyond the solar system, sending robotic probes could allow us to gather data from planets around other stars, an entirely new frontier in space exploration. While the challenges are considerable, radiation shielding, safety protocols, and the mass of nuclear reactors, the progress being made in technologies like NASA's Kilopower project and advancements in nuclear thermal propulsion show that we are steadily moving towards a future where nuclear propulsion becomes a practical tool for space exploration. This technology is a crucial piece of the puzzle that could allow humanity to explore the cosmos more efficiently and more effectively than ever before. Fission-powered propulsion could be the key to reaching the outer planets and beyond, providing reliable power for long-term space missions. With projects like NASA's Kilopower, this technology is set to play a crucial role in future exploration, enabling missions to distant planets and even interstellar space.